Hello, this is Eastpin Adam. We're happy to assist you with the upcoming presentation. Let us know if you need any help and we'll be glad to be of service. Follow our demo to install CentOS 8 on virtual machine. If user already have Linux OS, user can skip this installation CentOS 8 video. Just proceed with PuTTY installation then GitLab.
Congratulations. User success in installation of CentOS 8. For GitLab installation, user will using PuTTY software to SSH. Now, type PuTTY inside Google search, then press enter. User will click the download PuTTY as shown in this video. Click download PuTTY. Download PuTTY, compatible to your machines. In our demo, we are using 64-bit version. So let's download 64-bit PuTTY installer. The download begins. After finish download, install PuTTY. After complete install PuTTY, user open PuTTY as shown in the demo. Fill the hostname or IP address with user IP address previously with port 22, then click open. Rename as GitLab server. Click Save. Click Open. For first time use, it will show this messages. But don't worry, just click Accept. Prompt username as root. Prompt user password as. The password is the password that user set before. Then press enter. To set a hostname, we run command below. Copy. Then. Paste inside putty ssh. To know the current host name, run hostnamactl. As user can see, the host name have a sign is GitLab server. Run the command yum update, but it will get us errors. To solve this error, we run following commands. As user can see, the yum update now is in progress of updating. This video has been fast forwarded to provide a condensed view of the progress. Now, user must configure firewall to allow SSH and HTTP traffic by run following commands below into SSH.
It shows success. Very good. Next, install Postfix or SendMail to send notification emails. User run following commands below. After successfully configuring Firewall, we used the official GitLab Omnibus package to install GitLab. Run following command to download and install GitLab. This video has been fast forwarded to provide a condensed view of the progress. To install GitLab, run command below. But as user can see, the IP inside the command below is xx, so we need to find out the exact IP address of GitLab server inside the SSH. Now scroll up, as user can see, the exact IP address of GitLab installation is there. Type 112 inside. Copy command in notepad. Paste inside SSH. Press enter. Wait for installation. The waiting time depends on your internet speed. This video has been fast forwarded to provide a condensed view of the progress. If users see this message, GitLab installation is successful. After the complete installation of GitLab, user are prompted to run the command by copy sudo nano slash etc slash GitLab slash initial underscore root underscore password from notepad then paste it inside SSH then press enter. User will shown with the password generated by the SSH for login GitLab web. As a reminder, the password generated it only active at 24 hours.
If you would like to copy the password generated in the SSH into Notepad as reference, use Ctrl plus C. Now copy the IP address from Notepad then paste it later inside web browser for login GitLab web. As user can see, login GitLab page is appears. On the login page, fill the username as root. Then, fill the password generated by SSH. If you direct it into GitLab dashboard, user has successfully login into GitLab. Thank you for watching our presentation. We hope it was valuable and informative. For questions, contact us at info at or visit our website. Thank you again and have a great day.